Yeah. Hi everyone, a very warm welcome to you. Now as you can see from that last bit of footage, it's my, my name's Nick by the way, in case you didn't know. It's very muddy on this walk, so um, I've risked coming out. It's very windy as well, so apologies if the sound goes in and out even more than usual. But rather than stay in and film in a, uh, well, quite a stale room, I thought we'd come out anyway and see um, what happens. But the sky is very, very grey. It's spitting and spotting. And I might sink in quicksand. Uh, if I do, well, apologies for the sound quality if I go under the mud. But you know, you know how it is. So, uh, yes, we're into December. You probably noticed the countdown to Christmas is starting. And in the coming weeks, we'll probably put a few uh, Christmassy type of videos up as well. But yes, let's get a bit of fresh air, get a bit of recovery, and, um, well, have a bit of fun. Well, we'll try to. Yes, it's very, very wet indeed. Oh well. So yeah, I mean, uh, I was debating it for a little while. This is big news, so get your ears around this. Well, it's small news, it's minute news, it's almost no news, but uh, I didn't get an advent calendar in the end. Sorry, I didn't give you enough racing time there. No, I didn't get an advent calendar in the end. Supermarkets have stopped selling them. We're into December, but you can still buy them on Amazon. I've been looking at them, and they're pretty expensive, these um, advent calendars still. They haven't reduced in price, which you'd expect them to. We're into December. How long are they going to keep selling them? Maybe into January, I don't know. Um, but it used to be that you just open the doors and there'll be a picture of three wise kings pointing at a star, or... Um, um, can't think of anything else. A robin, red breast on a snowman, something like that. Uh, now you need Lego behind the doors, um, alcohol. You need something a bit more exciting because people are bored of the normal just pictures. So you've got to move across. I mean, um, I did look on uh, uh, Amazon there. They've got 30, 40 pounds and the rain, is <laughs> the rain is coming down again. Who's writing the script? Maybe I should have done it indoors. Anyway, I hope you enjoy this walk. Um, I'm not sure there'll be too much walking going on. I think there'll be lots of um, taking into shelter. I'm not sure how the sound's going to be as well. So, um, yeah, it's best to go for a walk in the summer than in the winter, as we're seeing. Oh, man, it's going to tip down. Why haven't I got... See, this hat is one of my cheapest hats, which I seem to wear most of the time. And it's corduroy. And it's... Yeah, corduroy, yes, I know. And it's not, uh, it's not waterproof at all. I might have to rinse it out somehow. But anyway, let's get going. Um before it really thunders and lightnings. If I get struck by lightning, apologies. Um, it's a saint that occasionally could happen, isn't it? Yeah, good. Wonderful. This route is probably going to be the slipperiest that I've ever encountered while I've been doing this walk. Why? Because there's lots of leaves on the ground, there's lots of water, and there's lots of mud. So let's go, let's go slow only a nincompoop would walk through here today so I doubt there'll be uh, many people I need to try and edit out of the um, of the footage because quite often you'll see these videos if you watch them of course and, uh, and you, you won't see hardly anyone in there well there's lots of people about but I just have to be very careful to edit them out or yeah or yeah sometimes these videos take shorter than others oh my goodness this ain't good Yeah, what was I worried about? That's fine. Going towards the clearing, which we all know. You know this walk off by heart, I'm sure you do. There it is. Okay, let's sit on burnt wood. Yeah! Okay, now when I go on these walks, quite often you might have seen me as I pass the camera sometimes, I will take a whiteboard with me and write on roughly things I want to talk about for the uh, walk. Sometimes it gets a little bit obscure with water going uh, on it and stuff like that. Um, have a look at my board now, if you can do, if it does focus on it. 
yeah, I mean, uh, that, that, <laughs> that's a little bit ineligible. Oh dear. Anyway, <laughs> show must go on. I know roughly what I was going to talk about. There's the shout outs there. Um, I'm sure I can remember it. I've got it on a bit of paper as well. Well done, Nick. Brilliant. I said on the um, last walk uh, that I was having a bit of an, an energy um, crash. Uh, it's because I pushed myself beyond what I can do and um, work-wise and on YouTube as well and you got you need to sort of like sort of like balance because if you um, work beyond what you're capable of uh, gradually your body doesn't fully um, regenerate every time and you get slightly less energy to work with until eventually you get a crash now I've managed to keep the channel um, going thank you for your kind uh, comments there not an issue it's just that the live streams have taken a bit of a hit because my energy wasn't there I've been looking after myself, getting plenty of water, vitamin D, which I think someone suggested on Twitter, so thank you there, because um, it gets dark quite early, and that's not good for energy as well. Less sunlight, less vitamin D, less energy. I'm doing that, vitamin C as well, and day by day, I have felt it gradually um, getting uh, better. I've got next week off, starting the 7th of December, so hopefully that's the aim, not definite, but hopefully the aim that we're going to do the live streams um, from that week onwards. I don't, I hate promising stuff I can't deliver, so I have to be a little bit careful on that, because my enthusiasm sometimes gets the uh, better of me. So I hope you've liked the videos that have gone up uh, this week. I think my favourites have been Alien Storm is good on the Commodore 64. I think my favourites was Jetpack um, RX. I did like looking at Siege, which is quite a, a basic game. We looked at it last Saturday. We were throwing like magenta rocks on the people below to stop them uh, going up the castle and taking over. It's a bit more um, basic than um, uh, Orc Attack we did in um, a few weeks ago and covered in, in the live stream. So yeah. I um, hope you've been uh, looking at those. We're going to do some more Christmassy videos, um, well, theme videos going up to Christmas. And yeah, good, 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 good. The rain seems to have stopped. I don't know if it's because we're sort of like undercover here, but I do get the feeling I'm being followed by something. I, I don't know uh, what, um, but sometimes you can be a bit paranoid, can't you, when there's nothing to worry about at all. Arcana. No mate, it's Nick Jenkins. No problem, mate. It's all right. No problem. See you later. Good luck. Lincoln poop. Take out the papers and the trash, or you don't get no spending cash. If you don't scrap that kitchen floor, you ain't gonna rock and roar no more. Yakety yak. Don't talk back. Okay, so we're getting quite near the, um, the road now that comes down the back of the woods. It might get a slightly bit noisy than uh, usual. Got a few other things I need to talk about, despite having... <laughs> what's, the, what's, the, what's the point of coming out with a white bit of board? I don't know. Maybe I can write notes down or something. Yeah, I want to, write, I want to talk about um, George Hamilton. Um, let's go by this tree. Not George Hamilton, George Russell. I'm, I'm mixing people up now. What a loony tune. Right. Oop. So not all of you follow the Formula One, but I, I follow it. It's been a very boring season with Lewis Hamilton winning practically uh, every race. But um, he's okay, Lewis, but he's, um, he's shown signs of COVID, so he can't race uh, this weekend in uh, Bahrain. So um, amazingly, George Russell, from driving for Williams the last few seasons on Mercedes books, never got a point in Formula One. Uh, he's been given... Um, Lewis Hamilton's drive for the weekend. Now, what a chance that would be. Obviously, he's up against Bottas, who knows the car really, really well. But what a chance. If, if Russell was to win the race, imagine that. Your first points in Formula 1 is a race win. I don't know if that's ever been done. Maybe Fangio's done it back in the 50s, but you stats people might know. The worst thing that can happen is he crashes early out and the opportunity is gone, but he's still on Mercedes books. The pressure is on Valtteri Bottas. If Valtteri Bottas doesn't out-qualify and doesn't beat him, there'll be serious questions and he'll probably lose his seat in 2022. So from boring races, that's been the occasional good one when Pierre Gasly has won. So from boring races, we've suddenly got something of interest there. So I don't know what you think about that. I'm at work, unfortunately, on Sunday, so I might miss the beginning of the race, but I really, really, really am interested to see how he gets on. He seems like he's a great driver. 
Uh, in all of his races for Williams, the few seasons he's done, he's never been out qualified by his teammates. He might be fast, or he might just have rubbish teammates. It's hard to know, but you can only get sort of like an idea of how quick a driver is when they race sort of like the best uh, uh, drivers. And there's been wind on the camera again. I think we get, get moving now that that Terminator twin's gone. Okay, so time for camera off because it's just getting too noisy down here. The, the leaves don't seem to be as slippery as I thought. Was it, you've got to be a bit, got to be a bit careful. Famous last words. So let's get out of here. Over we go. Watch out for wetness. Now there's some geese around here. You might have heard them on previous one, but I can't, oh, can't focus on one because it's on sort of like a private land. I can't focus through the fence. Anyway, that's a bit of extra information. Right, write that down in your notepads. Right, what was I supposed to be saying next? Uh, never mind, never mind, eh? Right, the last two weeks we've done this walk the other way round. Now we're doing it what I call the proper way round. But you know, what? there's not a proper way round. Oh, is there really? It's just one way or the other way. As Blondie once sang, did she? No, she said one way or another. Maybe next week. Hmm. God. Yak and yak. Don't talk back. Don't know if you can hear it, but the rain is coming down quite hard now. Okay. Okay. Now this field here. Uh, this is the vineyard. It's gradually, um, gradually developing. I think a few. Um, well, quite a few months yet before they've got grapes, but you know, the drainage is still going on and uh, going gradually uphill, that's going to be a little bit uh, tricky. But anyway, I'll do the shout outs in a moment, um, if you can hear me. Tricky stuff. My hands are absolutely freezing. Um, I'm not quite sure how much footage I've taken today with one thing or another. So apologies if it's uh, a bit shorter, but uh, you know, a walk is better than staying inside. And I still don't know if you can hear me or not, so hopefully you can. Now this is the members bit, so thank you for supporting the channel if you're a member. If you haven't already and you want to subscribe, please consider doing so because that helps as well. But the members thing is the thing that really helps the channel running, keep running. It starts from about $1.99 a month, which only do is not going to put you out, but it will help me because a lot of little bits obviously turn into a big bit and hopefully I can make this full time because YouTube is a little bit precarious. But I try and put up as much stuff as I possibly can, try and make it as fun as I possibly can and try and ease as much stress as I possibly can. There we go. With, 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 within reason, I've like, knocked myself out energy wise. Uh, and if you do the second tier and above, if you want to click on the join button, find out a bit more information, it won't commit you. So have a look at that if you want to. If you do the second tier and above, you'll get a shout out for anything you're doing. Unless you don't want me to, then let me know in the members section and you get access to the members area where you see what videos are going up in the next uh, month. Uh, or next week I should say and then hopefully I want to add extra uh, uh, videos to that section as well so huge thank you to members this week uh, Natty Nicky thank you there a new member uh, Claire Johnson uh, James O'Grady John Roby Jeffrey Searby thank you I know I speak to a lot of you on Twitter and a lot of you are quite active in the comments section and also the live streams when we uh, do them so I want to get back in touch there uh, Martin Rymel Stuart Laycock thank you Steve Norman Lemmy uh, Barnett Stephen Q N E U K. sorry for the lack of live streams I know you find it quite uh, useful but I really want to get back into those I keep saying this every week uh, Phil Hill, thank you. Keep looking around in case there's anyone coming up. Uh, Rossi Bossy, good luck with your game there. See that's still in development, looking good. Chono Baggy, <laughs> getting paranoid now. Ray Hulk 2, uh, Jason Holmes and Andrew Gibson. Thank you for all your support, really helps. And also people on the lower tier as well, because it all adds up. And massive thank you again to the four people that are generously on the top tier there, In Space Baby, Richard Mitten, Tom, Julie and Graham Bebke. So thank you very much there as my arm almost uh, gives way. And shout outs. <laughs> oh man, it's like a military operation this. Um, right, shout outs um, go to uh, Julie. We've, we shouted out this site next uh, last week. Same site again. 
So there might be a different one next week. It's uh, check this out. It's mygamingmemories.weebly.com. That's Julie Monkton's site there. Mygamingmemories.weebly.com. She's currently doing a daily advent calendar thing there as well. You click on the door and um, it reveals a game. Quite often a review by me. So hooray for that. So have a look at that. Mygamingmemories.weebly.com. Uh, it's like a blog as well. Um, some of Julie's memories um, diary at the time. So have a look at that if you haven't already done so. If you're a member on the second tier or above or we just shout anything out just let me know leave a direct message on twitter or in the members section uh directly on uh, youtube so thank you very much i'm now going to go back and try and edit this mess together as i generally do terminator and all uh, and uh yeah till next time take great care of yourself Be videos up saturday and sunday of course got next monday well next week off so we'll see how we go got to do a little bit of catching up because i feel a bit behind with the energy there but yeah what i'm basically trying to say is you lot are all brilliant so until next time, take great care of yourself and a very fond goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, E. And Jenkin. Oh man, where's all this goo coming from? <laughs>